got a little project today. My brother's coming to town. He'll be here tomorrow morning sometime. Uh, I really want to get the front yard looking nice. It's 4th of July weekend, and that's when your house outside should look amazing, right? Your curb appeal should look awesome. So I have a lot of projects to do. I have this front bed area it probably needs some new plants it's got to be de-weeded uh, i gotta put down some fabric uh to keep the weeds from coming up because i'm tired of pulling them uh the two trees kind of need some new mulch so uh gotta get on that if i have time i'm gonna try to wash the side of the house because homeowner association keeps on selling sending me a letter saying that my house has mold on it but you can hardly see it so i don't know what they're what they're thinking but i want to get that done uh so a busy afternoon uh, and i've already started a little bit just to show you what i mean this all this area in here needs to be done and see like the rocks are there but the weeds keep on coming through and i started taking some of the rocks out and i already have a plant being like basically choked to death right there he's just choked by all the weeds and stuff and a little tree growing so i gotta get this all nice maybe put some new plants in here uh and then finish putting the mulch and, and the fabric underneath this tree uh and then redo uh the mulch under this tree because it's uh, kind of faded so it is going to be a long afternoon of giving everything perfect so it looks awesome for the 4th of July. Hour and 15 minutes into this project, I wanna show you how much I've got done. I'm pretty proud of myself, look at this. I had halfway through on the first bed, uh, really positive that, you know, this might not be an all day project. We'll see. To the Lowe's to get some plants, mulch, everything else that we needed to finish up this project today. Did I think I only went about $17 over what I thought I was going to spend. So I feel like I'm right on budget. So we're going to load up the car, get it back, get the stuff planted. And I just realized I forgot to buy one thing. Oh, I got the uh, garden fabric so I don't have any more weeds. So I don't have to do this ever again. So now I'm set to go back and finish up this project. Started to put the fabric down so we can get the mulch back on uh it is almost uh four o'clock so then we got to plant those plants over there get those in and uh then we'll be done for the night this is just a bigger project than i thought it was going to be it started off going pretty pretty quick but uh, as the heated day hit on i just didn't move as fast as i did earlier in the day uh, i've been going at it since about 10 30 this morning um I think I'm gonna finish the one tree, pack up, and uh, and leave some stuff for tomorrow morning when it's a little bit cooler. Uh, me and Tanya have to do some shopping to get ready for my brother and sister-in-law to be here. So get some food. Want to get a couple other things to dress up the front, uh, new doormat, wreath, that kind of stuff. Uh, so, whew. and then eat dinner because I haven't eaten anything uh, since breakfast. So I'm a little on the hungry side. Still doing a little shopping, trying to finish up everything. Uh, we're going to Home Goods to see if they have a wreath, and I feel really naked because I don't have a Starbucks in my hand. Normally, oh. when we do these girly shopping <laughs> things, real. I have my Starbucks. What was I thinking? No Starbucks to go on your shopping excursion to Home no, Goods? Oh. No. Hmm. Well, hopefully it's they have. Because we're saving room for wine. Yeah, I we're need gonna... wine in my life. We're gonna have some wine. Trying Kirkland's. See if we can succeed with one wreath that's all we're wanting something to put on the door that's it something we got to find it mission accomplished we didn't get really a wreath but we got this nice little flowery thing you'll see it tomorrow uh a decorative see decorative a thing decorative for a, the door. a decorative for the door nate burke has picked it out yeah all by himself yeah i'm pretty good at these things you did ask for my opinion which i did give since i wasn't able to finish all the landscaping that'll be tomorrow so you'll have to kind of wait an extra day to see the finished product of landscaping door the whole nine yards. So good times, folks. Yeah, yeah. but we're gonna go get a glass of wine at Rioja, having a nice uh, glass of wine after a busy, hectic day. I have the New Age, Tanya. You have the risk taker. Risk taker. So uh, I guess you could say that this vlog is winding down. <laughs> what a